It's been a long and nerve-wracking wait, with countless enthusiasts keeping their eyes glued to the skies and jumping at every notification on their phones. Even fake videos titled, Finally Starship Launched, have been fooling many into thinking they missed the action. But at last, the moment we've all been waiting for is almost here. Elon Musk just took to Twitter to share a jaw-dropping video of SpaceX's Starship, the world's most powerful rocket, sitting tall and mighty on the launch pad in Boca Chica, Texas. SpaceX has also taken to Twitter to announce that Starship is ready for its highly anticipated test flight. This launch will take place at the company's test facilities in Boca Chica, Texas. As we speak, the Starship is fully stacked and awaiting the final green light to take to the skies. It's worth noting that SpaceX has postponed its schedules multiple times before, often due to technical issues, weather conditions, or other unforeseen complications. However, this time, there's an air of confidence and excitement surrounding the launch, suggesting the company has resolved any major issues and is ready to make history. The countdown is set to begin next week with a launch rehearsal. Assuming all goes well, the actual launch attempt will follow just a week later, no earlier than April 17th. Of course, it's important to note that SpaceX still needs a launch license before the event can take place. Although there's a chance the license could be granted by Monday, April 10th, it's crucial to keep our eyes and ears open for any sudden changes. Elon Musk himself has admitted that there's a 50% chance of Starship exploding during liftoff. In typical Musk fashion, though, he guarantees the launch won't be boring. However, the SpaceX team's unwavering determination to push boundaries and make significant advancements in space travel is evident, and that has helped them reach this important milestone. If this launch were to go wrong, the consequences could range from minor setbacks to significant financial and reputational impacts. A failed launch could result in a loss of confidence from investors, partners, and potential clients. This could delay SpaceX's ambitious plans for future missions, including crewed missions to the Moon and Mars, as well as satellite launches and other commercial projects. In the event of an explosion or other catastrophic failure, there could be environmental concerns as well. The debris and potential fuel spillage could have negative impacts on the local ecosystem and require extensive cleanup efforts. Moreover, a failed launch would necessitate an in-depth investigation to determine the root cause of the failure. This could lead to further delays as SpaceX addresses any discovered issues, updates safety protocols, and works to regain the confidence of regulators and the public. While Elon Musk is warned of a 50% chance of explosion during liftoff, such risks shouldn't overshadow the significance of SpaceX's achievements thus far. The company has successfully launched and landed numerous Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy rockets, as well as deployed hundreds of Starlink satellites to provide global internet coverage. Now, you might be wondering what exactly is involved in a launch rehearsal that will be taking place before the actual launch. Essentially, this is a dry run of the many procedures SpaceX engineers will perform on the actual launch day. This includes pumping liquid oxygen and liquid methane propellant into both the Super Heavy first stage and the Starship upper stage of the vehicle. This rehearsal will help to verify the full launch countdown sequence and assess the performance of Starship and its orbital pad for flight-like operations. It's worth mentioning that this isn't the first time Starship has gone through such tests. In fact, earlier this year, the massive rocket successfully completed its first full wet dress rehearsal and static fire test of its 33 Raptor engines, paving the way for the upcoming test flight. There's no denying that this test flight is a high stakes event for SpaceX, and the world is watching with bated breath. If all goes according to plan, this will pave the way for future missions to the Moon, Mars, and beyond. But of course, with great power comes great responsibility and the possibility of setbacks. Should anything go awry during the test flight, SpaceX may need to ground its rocket and analyze the data to determine what went wrong. This could potentially set back the company's plans to launch its second-generation Starlink satellites and delay NASA's Artemis program, which relies on Starship as its lunar lander. The spacecraft is designed to be fully reusable, a game-changing advancement that will drastically reduce the cost of space travel. With the capacity to carry up to 100 passengers at a time, Starship brings us closer to the dream of colonizing Mars and embarking on ambitious lunar missions. The Starship owes its impressive features to its unique stainless steel structure, which boasts several advantages. The material offers superior heat resistance, allowing for the rocket's reuse with minimal refurbishment. 
Additionally, its Super Heavy booster will harness the power of 33 Raptor engines to deliver unparalleled thrust, propelling Starship into orbit. In other major news, NASA and Axiom Space have recently confirmed the first possible launch date on May 8th, with the SpaceX Dragon spacecraft taking off from Launch Complex 39A at Kennedy Space Center in Florida. This mission is also groundbreaking in several ways. For one, the AX-2 mission features a diverse crew, with members representing private astronauts, foreign government representatives, and legendary space pioneer Peggy Whitson. This incredible woman will make history once more as the first female mission commander for an Axiom spaceflight. The crew includes private astronaut and pilot John Schaffner, as well as mission specialists Ali Al Karni and Rayana Barnawi, who are part of Saudi Arabia's first national astronaut program. This collaboration highlights the ever-growing global cooperation in space exploration and sets the stage for even more international partnerships. Let's not forget the spacecraft that's making this mission possible, the SpaceX Dragon. Currently undergoing refurbishment at Cape Canaveral in Florida, the spacecraft, nicknamed Freedom, has already completed nine human spaceflights. The Dragon will be transported to the launch complex by the end of the month, ready for its first launch with the Falcon 9 booster. The growing global space marketplace is becoming more inclusive, and according to Angela Hart, manager of NASA's Commercial Low Earth Orbit Program Office, we can expect an exponential expansion in the scope of people touched by these missions. Michael Sufredini, Axiom Space's president and CEO, emphasizes the importance of what they are doing. He believes that their efforts will not only serve the markets, but also help humanity learn to live off planets, a crucial skill for our survival as a species. With these groundbreaking developments, the sky is no longer the limit. The AX-2 mission represents a milestone in the journey towards accessible space travel and global cooperation in space exploration. If you've enjoyed this coverage and want to stay informed on SpaceX's progress and other exciting space-related news, please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. By doing so, you'll be supporting our efforts to provide engaging content. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one!